Welcome to Lunch Break Feminist Club. Today, the first thing on the agenda is welcoming our new member, Anastasia. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Anastasia, can you tell us a little bit about yourself? Oh, I would love to. I have always been a feminist. I follow all of the feminist ideals. Many different feminist clubs. The Bridgeport Feminist Club of Girls for Girls and Feminist Anonymous. So I have a little bit of rounded out nature. But really, I've just had so much experience holding positions at so many other feminist clubs. I think that I would be a very, very good a benefit to your group and I'm um, excited. Okay, I think we're ready to move on to item number two, which is, oh, <gasps> happy National Bitches <gasps> Day. Bitches Day, yay! I'm, I'm okay. sorry, but did I just hear you say bitches? <laughs> yeah, National Bitches Day. Congratulations, women. Yes. See, yeah, the, there you go again with that. <laughs> word. Um, I I don't quite understand why it's being used. Maybe you're not aware that August 26, 2015 marks the 95th anniversary of Women's Equality Day, celebrating the 19th Amendment. Well, of course I do. August 26th is also National Dog Day. So? so when you put the two together, that makes it National Bitches Day. <laughs> National Bitches Day! I'm sorry, but do you not realize that the terminology you're using is derogatory? Bitches Day! God, it's like, every time you say that, it's like I feel every woman in history's suffrage is too much. It's too much. Um, Anastasia, can you pull yourself together for the club meeting, please? Do you have a problem with National Bitches Day and our ability to celebrate that? I mean, of course not. I would never want to detract. Excuse you. Excuse you. Just excuse you. Please. I'm sorry, Anastasia, but you're just not a fit for our club. Mm -hmm. Oh. Please leave now. Bitches. <sighs> Subscribe here, bitches.